Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Marketing Coffee Hour. Rashid Huda joined Alignable because someone told him about it. And like most of us, he promptly forgot about it. Then one day, he got an email that said, congratulations, you are a highly recommended business on Alignable. Say what? Who? How? What the? Needless to say, it got his attention and he dug into it. Now he is an Alignable ambassador for his local alliance and builds and enjoys building relationships and telling everyone about Alignable. Welcome, Rashid. You can take over the meeting. Well, I've been bugging uh, Candace by Alignable for a little while. And when I say a little while, maybe a couple of months or so. And she said, yeah, I know. I've heard that Alignable has up their games and but I got too many things going on and I keep bugging her. And so last, last week when I was online and Kendra said, Hey, I got an opening. You want to do business? I said, okay. So here we are. Uh, I am going to just jump right into it and uh, start sharing my screen and uh, go along with what I, and seeing and what I'm showing you. Now, if I could figure out where my, uh, there it is, but that's uh, that's a post attendee Zoom meeting. That's not what I want to share, but let me go there and then go to where I want to go. Okay. So, <clears throat> uh, Alignable has a lot of mixed conceptions about what Alignable is. People have that misconceptions about Alignable. So let's get started with what is Alignable and what Alignable is not. Oh, I got to admit somebody. Okay. No, I'll, I'll do it. it. Okay. Uh, as you can see right here, it says Alignable is a small business referral network. It's a small business referral network. It is not, and I repeat, it is not a social media platform. It's a business referral not a network, particularly for small businesses. Their tagline is build your own network, build your business. Okay. What Alignable also is not is something like LinkedIn. We, uh, Candace and I got into that last week. No, she said it was something like LinkedIn. I said, no, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Alignable is not like LinkedIn. LinkedIn, I say, is Facebook for corporate world, where people just get in and act silly. Alignable is more like Tinder for business people. And it's not for creating romantic relationships is for creating business relationships. As a matter of fact, Alignable is built on the same kind of an AI uh, algorithms as Match.com. It takes what you're looking for and what you who you are and what you're looking for and goes out there and goes, okay, these two people need to meet because they're sharing what their wants and needs and haves. So when you enter Alignable, this is what you will see. This is your homepage. And it's got, uh, and I'll go to Candace's homepage and show you what that looks like. This is her pro profile. And that's not what Candace would see when she logs in. She would see something similar to this, but except it would have Candace's uh, information right here. And it would have Candace's picture that says, right, post. And this is your timeline, basically. And you go through that, but I'll get that get into that in a minute. The first thing that you want to do when you join Alignable is build your profile because if you don't have a profile, Alignable doesn't know who to, who to connect you with and you can't build referral partnership because Alignable doesn't know who to send connect you with. 
they'll just connect you with random people or recommend random people for you to get connected with. And that doesn't really work. So first thing you want to do is go where it says my profile, or you can click on your picture. Click on your, now you won't have your picture when you first go in because you haven't put the picture in. I'm going to move this window up here. Can I move this up here somehow? Uh, yeah, no, maybe there. I just see one person rather than the whole whole group, but then that, okay. No, here, okay. So on the right-hand side of your profile page, you won't see this uh, because, and I'll get into that why in a minute, but you might see these things and I'll talk about this in just a minute, but this is where you have your opportunity and there's an edit button, you put in your app where you are. Uh, as a matter of fact, hang on a second. Let me go here and go to uh, profile. Okay, I can't find that edit button. There's gotta be an edit button here somewhere that says, uh, as you can tell, I'm not an expert on this. There. So this is what you do is you fill in your, uh, no, no, nope. Uh, here, group, I'm trying to say to my profile. There should be something that said my profile over here. Okay. My profile. Okay, that's what we were looking at. But when you when you get in, and I think I know where it is, it's in settings or accounts. Nope, not in the accounts. But when you get started, you would have, I make it easier, okay? There is a website and you can write down the URL for it. The URL for the website is learnfromsue.com. Learn from Sue.com. And uh, when you go to learn from Sue.com, it does not say learn from Sue.com in the window because this is a forward to that page. And uh, when you go to learn from Sue, this is what you will see. The first thing you'll see is come on, I'm unalignable. Now what? And you want to go to there and spend some time, um, attend the live session or watch a recording. I say, watch the recording. Uh, in 30 minutes, this lady explains to you everything you need to know to set up your profile so that it would do what it's supposed to do. Okay. Once you have filled in, and there are two things that I would say that you need to do immediately. One is, uh, I'm gonna go to my profile here, is as you scroll down on the right-hand side, this is this will be populated from uh, your information that you fill in. Make sure it's correct. And there's an opportunity to edit. But right here where it says, you, our team, this picture won't be there. It would have your initials. It would say RH and see if I can find a quick example of that. Um, go to home. Yeah. Come on, somebody's got to be there. That Ben just updated his picture, but this person here. Okay, and I met him a couple of days ago. See, he's got this. And when you go down here, he doesn't have his picture. His name is there, but he's got his initials. So what you want to do is click on that, and it would bring up an edit button. You can put your picture there. And the other thing that you want to do is right here where he's got Gap Bookkeeping, his logo. Don't do that. Even though Alignable says put your logo there, put your picture there. 
because when people want to meet you and they say, you know, for example, if I go to my network, my network, come on, and it tells me uh, who I can suggest to and all of that stuff. If I click on this guy here, I don't know who this person is. Their picture is not showing up. They may have their picture here in the team. See, he doesn't even have, yeah, he has his picture in the team. But I don't see him when I go to his profile. So you want your picture here instead of your logo. Also, this right here is your billboard on Alignable. And make it worth it. Create it. Get creative. I've used Canva to create mine. Rashid, uh, I have a question about that. Okay. Talk so when you click on the circle, you're connecting to a business, not an individual person. And that business could have multiple people that work at it. That is a possibility. If scroll down to that, go, go back to that Texas Energy Star. All right. Uh, Texas Energy Star. And then scroll down to where all the people work. Okay. So if you click on those, oh, it's only him. Yep. Um, so when you click on Alan Blair, what do you get? Same thing. You'll, I'll get the same uh, profile. See, I can't even click on it because okay. he's the only one there. So find one that has. You won't find it. These are all individual ones. So even if you work for different companies, each one of you would have your own page. Okay. There is, it's, it's, it's a small business kind of like entrepreneurship. Like I said, it's a match.com, not a LinkedIn where you can have a corporate page and uh, everybody's, you know, got their own, own thing there. No, it won't. These are all individual pages belonging to you. That's why uh, we say don't put the company logo there. Your company information can come over here if if you work, you know, if you're a salesperson or a network marketing person who wants to promote your company rather than come promoting yourself, then that's fine. But this is where you're, see, if I go to Candace's thing, see, it says right there, accountability coach for solopreneurs who procrastinate. That's her billboard. And this is my billboard. Embrace your inner weirdo, entertaining entrepreneurship education. So that's what you want to do is you want to make it, and this is where I have my Embrace Your Inner Weirdo podcast uh, thumbnail. So I have two different pictures, but my picture is there regardless. So when somebody pulls up my profile, they'll see this, not that. But when, they, when we're having communications, so if I go to notifications, it would have, see this guy has a lineable, uh, of kind of the well, oh, this notification says that somebody joined the alignable alliance of condo, and I'll come to that in a second. But I see that's a bit, a bit uh, see, this guy has his name, and this person has their logo. So that's the difference. This person, you know, she's got her name, and this person only has just initials because they did not put the picture. And no color. They, and you know, like they're here, there's nothing because they didn't even do anything. You want to put your picture. So when a notification comes, you know who you're talk, talking to rather than some no name, uh, no name, no knowledge, who don't know who this person is. So going back to um, our homepage, this is where you're. This is your timeline. See, there it is. He's just told me that Candace up, updated her user photo. So I'm going to say like, share, and I can share with my network and say, oh, I can say whatever I want. I if say, you need a to... kick in your butt, Candace can help you. <laughs> and I'm just going to say, way to go. <laughs> but Okay, so that, and then when you look at your profile, 
as you're filling out the profile, the things that you want to fill out is this right here. Who is our ideal customer? Because that's what you want to tell them, you know, and this is my current spiel would change about a week ago and it's going to change again pretty soon because uh, I've kind of compressed that. Uh, and I'm going to call, I'm going to just say, and somebody liked it when I said it, several people liked it when I said it. I help uh, people in the second half of their life figure out who they want to be when they grow up. That's my ideal uh, customer avatar. And then this other part could be there. This is an important part. You want to put in the tax. And I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time because that learn from Sue thing that I talked about, she goes into detail on why you want to do this and how to do it. But this four sections right here, who is your ideal customer, uh, your tax, what business can you partner with, meaning who is going to be a referral partner, and tags so that that's what Alignable does. It takes these tags and these tags and finds commonality and recommends, oh, you need to meet with this person. This is who you need to talk to, okay? And this So is I noticed that you have tagged yourself Toastmasters. What's the yes. strategy with that? Well, Toastmasters are a group where people can find people in the second half of their life who are trying to figure out where, what they want to be when they grow up. So a Toastmaster would be a good referral partner for me, or a Toastmaster okay. organization would be a referral partner for me. I also have Rotary Clubs for the same reason. Tell your story is very important. It says 7 million businesses, now it's eight. They just hit the 8 million mark. Oh, another difference between uh, LinkedIn and Alignable. Alignable is only in Canada and USA. And it's all about small businesses, mom and pop places, local alliances, not international. Uh, the other thing about Alignable is it's not a place where you uh, sell your wares. It's a place where you make connections. So fill this two part about who you are, you know, thinks about you, who you are, and how you got started. This is what would interest people who want to build relationships. They go, oh, this person looks interesting. I want to connect with them. Okay. And Candace can tell you all about uh, that. The next part is the recommendation. You can receive recommendation and you can send recommendation. These are the recommendations that I have received. I've received 33 recommendations, and you can see that right up here. It says recommendation 33. When you get five recommendations, you get a badge that says uh, you are highly recommended. That's what got my attention. When I got that email saying, you, you know, you're highly recommended. I'm going, huh? How did that happen? Well. People obviously saw me, people knew me, wrote recommendations for it. Now, what a lot of people do initially, like a lot of, and I probably ended up deleting all those five that got my attention because all they were were simply this. Let me go over here and this guy over here, right? I'm not even connected to him. So let me go find somebody that I may be connected to. I go to my network. Yeah, now go to my community. And this is my community and there's somebody, okay, this person here, I've already recommended him. Uh, I have a quick question. Go ahead. If a person has a different businesses, would they set up a profile for each business or just uh, put everything under one? Good question. Uh, remind me again in a few minutes, and I will uh, will tell you what. While I'm here, I'm going to bring up this one. Um, oops. 
There's not two C's, there's only one C. There's also a question from Susie about, uh, Susie, from Susan about whether or not Alignable would work for real estate agents. Uh, there are probably a whole bunch of uh, people on Alignable that are realtors. See this one right here? She is an author, a businesswoman, energy healer, and holistic choice advocates. These are all different businesses for her that she is promoting on Alignable. Her main business, her main business is construction. She is a construction contractor. Been doing that for 25 years. Built that using our favorite tool, send our card, building relationships. But she never, ever, ever, ever mentioned send out cards on Alignable. It's not about selling your product. It is about. Now you Thank could, you. Thank nothing, you so much. Yeah. Nothing says that you can't because I give you another example. Uh, and some of you might know who this person is, right? It's okay. Cindy. It's oh, Cindy, it Cindy Justice. Is it Cindy Justice? Okay. Uh huh. No. Is it why? Just hit enter and see what happens. Well, there it is. Keeping in touch with Cindy Justice. There it is. Right there. It's all. Oh, she has changed it. She used to have. Uh, send out car prominent over here. So she has If you changed. go back to the profile from the person that you were looking at before and you scroll down to the bottom, you see that she offers send right. out cards Correct. as a product. Yes. And it's, it's highlighted on her page. Right. On the bottom. See, that's where your services, this is where, where you have your um, products and services right here. Okay, this is where you do whatever you want to do, whatever you're selling. This is where you do it, not up here. Up here, you're building relations. Now, your whole thing is about building relationships. And yes, you have this opportunity, but the successful people on Alignable don't talk about their products in the, in the public. They talk so about to go it. back to answer Karen's question, she was mm -hmm. wondering if she could promote multiple businesses. Well, it yes. looks like under products and services, that's where she would. That's do where, that. right, exactly. So this is where she has all her businesses um, being sold: her book, her uh, trainings, her line. Uh, looks like that is her. So for those yeah. of you who are with right. Send Out Cards, all of you could do that with the Promptings Process book. You can just copy what she does and mm -hmm. use the Promptings Process book as one of your products and services. Okay, so now let me move on to the features of this uh, rather than spending more time on the, now, and before I get into the features, when you join Alignable, you get 10 connection credits. And it's free. It's a free account and you get 10 connection credits. And you might think, well, that's not a whole lot. Or can you build relationships with more than 10 people in a meaningful way in a month? Well, that's plenty of credit. You don't want to be, you're not on Facebook where you're going to click, join, you know. You're not building imaginary friends. You're building a network. So you don't want to connect to just about anybody. You want to, when you find something in your timeline feed, you see, hey, hey, Carol, congratulations. She changed your picture. Okay. All right. There is this person writing contracts. Rendered. As a matter of fact, I connected to somebody this morning because I was playing with my uh, no, messages part. Uh, okay. This hasn't showed up because she hasn't accepted. But I saw somebody who sells uh wall photographs she sells creates 
wall art. So I connected with her saying, hey, that's what I do too. Let's connect, let's get to know each other. So I'm definitely going to not only connect with her, I'm going to also set up a one-on-one -on -one with her. If you send somebody a connection request and they don't accept it, too bad, too sad, it's gone. You blew it. So be, be picky about who you connect to. You can become a premium member, which costs you 30 bucks a month, but you get 40 connection credits. So now you can be more selective, a little less selective. Now, if somebody sends you a connection request and you accept it, it doesn't count towards your 10. If you invite somebody that you know, like Candace sent out an email to the group, I think, that said, join Alignable. And if you joined it, it did not count towards her 10 connections for the month. You can have Alignable look at your uh, contact list and Alignable would go through that and say, these people are already on Alignable and connect you with them saying, hey, you know this person, they are on Alignable, you're on Alignable, you should be connected. And then it will offer you to send an invitation to everybody on your uh, contact list. Don't do that. Skip it. Or say unselect and then go through your list and find business people that you really want to be doing business with and invite them. And when they join, it doesn't count toward your 10 a month. So there are ways to get more more connections. But I'm a premium member, so I get 40 connections every month that I can connect to, that I can invite people one morning. Some of them may not want to connect with me, some of them may. So that's up to them. We've got questions uh, in the chat. All right, let's hear it. Um, to clarify, the 10 connections on a free account are new people to Alignable. And is it 10, 10 connections a month or 10 connections total? 10 connections per month. And it's for new, not new people on Alignable. It's people that are already on Alignable that you want to connect to, that you, that you can send a connection request to. So it's it's... It's a nice to meet you. It's a hand. It's a permission to make a handshake. Yeah, kind of. Uh, let me see if I can find the when how I can. Um, okay, let me go to home and uh, put in. If you aren't already friends with Marianne, put in Marianne and, and make a friend connection to her, so we can see what that looks like. Okay. Uh, spell your name for me, Marianne. M A R I E A N N E. Is there a hyphen? Hyphen A N N E. A N N E. R O U S. Okay. Uh, e. There she is, right there. Right. There she is. Okay. So now I'm not connected to her. So I'm going to say connect. And this is what's going to show up. Don't pick one of these three. That Unless you know each other and you're doing it quickly. <laughs> Uh, yeah, <laughs> even if you know each other, don't do it because it's not really, uh, if I get one with one of these things, I just kind of don't even bother looking at their profile because what they're telling me is they're just, they're not aware of what they're doing. And Ooh, I may yeah. go back, or I may go back. I would just put in here and say, uh, I'm going to move this and pull out my portable thing from underneath my thing. Uh, it was a great workshop last week. Ooh, that's a good thing to say. And then because uh, you're she, complimenting her, right? So now when she gets this, she goes, "Oh, who's this guy? What workshop is she?" So now she's gonna look at my. Uh, so that's what you want to do is you you want to make a genuine correction, not just a generic invitation now marianne had a question so click on her profile okay and she says that she just noticed that she was local business person of 2023 so what does that mean she is a lot that means people in her community voted for her as a credible uh, appreciative business they 
people in her network, in her community, voted for her to be somebody that they want to connect to, that they recommend. Congratulations, Marianne. Yeah, and this is recognized by uh, Alignable. It says our recognition. So I'll go back to my profile, and I said I'll talk about that later. So let me go there real quick and show you show off my recognitions. See, it says our recognition. There's four of them. I've got that local business 2023. I'm also an alignable ambassador, and I'll talk about that in a minute. And I know I'm running out of time. Community supporter. It means that I. I recommended 10 different people within my community to be honored uh, to, and they may not be necessarily in my community. They, they would be in their community that I know that, you know, it's so I, I could have, I may have recommended Candace. I don't know if I was connected with her at that time or not. This happens every year in January for a couple of months. And highly recommended is something that you want to, and at five, you get that recognition, but then you also get a mention that you're more than 25, and you also get another mention if you have more than 50. There is no more recognition after that. And right up here, see where it says uh, 33, uh, so it shows up. These are, this is how many connections I had. Most of these uh, I made on Alignable. When I started, uh, connecting to the people that I knew and the people from my uh, contact list, I had about 100. So the other 250 I made through Alignable, most of them who had reached out to me because I was active on Alignable. Now, when you become a premium, premium member, you are able to see the analytics of your account. You may see this if you're not a... And let me see if Marianne is, uh, Marianne, are you a, uh, well, okay, Candace is not a, I know you, you're not a, uh, oops, why, why did I do that? I had your profile. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I, changing my header was the first time I'd been on a liable, a liable okay. in a long time. Okay, so you, you don't see where it says how many people have looked at your thing or whatever, correct? Correct. Not because, on your page. I do it on, I see it on mine. Oh, uh, Okay. You see it on yours that so says on, on my page. Oh, okay. right now I have yeah. your page. Um, Go ahead. On Go my to page, page it says I've had sixty-six connections, six recommendations, and five referrals, twenty-one visits, ninety-eight impressions, and zero okay. advice form. All right, connect. Try connecting on any of them. And it says upgrade to unlock. Correct. Okay. So. When I am a premium, as a premium member, you unconnect, uh, unlock it. And say, so if I did this right here, there it is, okay? It's all my activity. These are the people that visited 15 hours ago. This guy came to my uh, page. Uh, these are the people that visited my page. These are the people, you know, I can look at their profiles. I can see who, came, who uh, did what on my page, and I can choose to connect with them. And if I see, find somebody that said something nice about me or came to mind and I like their profile, I can send them a connection notice. So that's one of the, one of the advantages. The other thing is uh, I am also an uh, ambassador. Alignable is working on building local alliances, what they are calling an alliance, which is a in-person local alliance where you meet with people locally. We had a meeting yesterday, uh, well, actually Tuesday, and we had 15 people there. That's part, I am part of the Conroe Alliance. Right now I'm the co-ambassador for the Conroe Alliance because it was there and I felt that it would be better to be a co-ambassador to learn the roads and build the alliance rather than splitting up and kind of creating a, a bad feeling among each other saying you took part of my group so we're working together when it gets big enough uh, we'll split it up for the interest of the community 
That's the idea, and that, that's the plan. Then I'll become the ambassador for the Spring uh, Alliance. When you become an ambassador, you get lots and lots and lots of uh, benefits. But here is one big benefit. See what this says right here? I have 73 credits remaining because I get 100 credits every month. I had 75 this morning. I sent one to that lady that I was talking about who's a photographer. And I sent one to Marianne. So now I'm down to 73. Yeah, the eyes. But let uh, me show you the amazing stuff like she had. Look at this. In her size, do you know how many, like, like we have an issue with the eyes, like sizes she have? I'm not uh, quite getting what, what you're saying, Deb. She was playing a video in the background. I muted her. Ah, okay. Okay, gotcha. Gotcha. So okay. Rita asked about LinkedIn and Alignable being connected. They're not. They're completely different animals altogether, independent of each other. So Alignable yeah. is a little bit like a networking, a virtual networking, and LinkedIn is more like a virtual um, uh, CV. Okay. Is a, a uh, resume, like your virtual okay. resume. Yeah. Uh, Alignable is not like a network. It is networking. It's, and their focus is not just virtual. Their focus is local live. So that's where the alliances come in. Okay. You can create an alliance in your neighborhood, in your town, in your area, and... Uh, Create events and invite people on Alignable in your, so you have your, uh, like my community. I am in Woodlands, okay? And every week you get a newsletter from your community. And uh, so the, this is what is happening in Woodlands. So and in I order to, to host events, you have to have a paid subscription. I am not 100% sure but i think that may be a correct uh thing i'll tell you what uh while you're on on here go to uh uh where did i okay go go to your home page mm -hmm. and uh click on create a post write a post well i have to make it bigger Oh, I have an option to create an event. There you go. So you can and it an says event. virtual events on Alignable, um, sharing a promotional event, event for your biz, start here. In person. Oh, you can. You can. Yes. Okay. But it can only be in Muskegon. If it's an in-person, yeah, it would be in your, your neighborhood. But okay. you would get... Alignable would promote it in Muskegon and five other surrounding communities. And you may be able to choose what those five communities are. Okay. Um, did I see any more questions? Um, no. Marianne said gamification badges, which is absolutely correct. Okay. Questions for Rashid, because it's time to wrap up. Yep. Pick his brain while he's okay. here. All right, a quick, quick uh, uh, tip on how to get meet more people is go to groups, and there are all kinds of groups, and there are events happening in the group. Go to a Smart Connect group, a Smart Connect event. A Smart Connect is kind of like Quick Connect and BNI, except it is uh, geared for it is Alignable's own branded quick connect so when two people go into a breakout room their profiles would be right underneath their names and pictures so immediately you would know uh, you can check out this person's profile and what they have done in addition to talking to them for about six minutes and getting to know to decide whether you want to do a one-on-one -on -one with them or not so smart That's connecting is like speed networking right but when you go into a breakout room, you have each other's profile in the room. Cool. You can, yeah. So you want to do that. 
And that would be the fastest way to build your network on uh, Alignable. Uh, also, see on my left, you see a whole bunch of uh, groups that I belong to, and that list is pretty long. Uh, I'm not active on, on most of them, as you can see, because all that red star means I haven't checked them lately. Can uh, you schedule an event? Yes. Uh, I'm sorry, a schedule a post, or do you have to post as you go? Uh, yeah, I do believe you can uh, schedule it. Uh, okay. When you, yeah, when you finish it, it will give you an option to schedule uh, when you want it to go up. I do believe that is the case. And Marianne suggested that when you are the featured speaker at your networking meeting, you can create an event on Alignable to invite people to attend. Smart idea. Very smart idea. Yes. And All right, that guys. Would be, that would last, be an Alignable event. Last call for questions for Rashid. Send me a request. I'll add you. Or send me an email, and it won't cost you a request. All right, Rashid, please stop sharing your screen. Rashid, can you drop your email address into the chat? Yes, I will. Thank you very much. All right, thank you, Rashid. That was really, My really pleasure. good information. Um, so today was all about Alignable with Rashid. And here, let me pin myself so that I'm featured speaker view, um, full screen uh, speaker. Okay, so. Did it, are you guys looking at me or did I do that wrong? Yeah, I see you with my picture. Um, I want to put well, myself a, as a featured speaker. Oh, you do that okay. over here, Candace. Duh. No. Okay, there Duh. you are. Over here, pin myself, spotlight for everyone. Okay, so thank you, Rashid. If you want my to pleasure. see the replay, it will be available tomorrow. Tomorrow, by, by the end of the day, tomorrow at momgeek.com forward slash coffee replays. You do need to create an account to view replays. It's free. You just sign up, you create a username and password. And when you're logged in, you can click on momgeek.com forward slash coffee replays, and you'll be able to see all the replays. Um, our upcoming topics next week, we have a copywriter, an actual copywriter coming in and teaching us how to use chat GPT so that you you get the best results as a copywriter. Uh, she's not going to be giving us prompts. She's going to be teaching us how to manipulate ChatGPT. May 25th, we're doing your business one-liner. June 1st, we're going to do 100 social media posts in 45 minutes. And I'm thinking 100 alignable posts in 45 minutes, maybe? I don't know. Uh, we'll, we'll see what happens by June 1st. On June 8th, I'm going to teach you how to use this tool called Prezi Video for Zoom that I'm using to show you the slides on my screen right now. Um, I'm actually doing a... Um, I'm helping Prezi for Zoom right now test the product in the field and then um, giving them my feedback. And so after I've done all that, I'll actually be able to teach it to you uh, because I will have gone through the testing process. And if you know someone who would benefit from one of those classes, you register at momgeek.com forward slash coffee to get on the email list to get the reminders of the Thursday classes. Our next Robusta is Monday. It's at noon Eastern or nine Pacific. Robusta is the premium version of coffee hour. So we spend 90 minutes doing group coaching. We dig deep into some, you know, we people bring questions and we dig deep into those questions. It's $25 a month to belong to Robusta and to register for that. It's mongeek.com forward slash register. And last but not least, here are the links.